Uh, John Steiner, hypnotherapist, PhD, Joyce Myers, all of them, their expert medical uh, opinions, uh, write that uh, I am a victim of psychotronic mind control attacks and my symptoms are direct results uh, of these attacks. Uh, I have developed a post-traumatic stress disorder because of them. Uh, and I do not show any uh, signs of uh, delusional disorder or psychosis. Dr. June Steiner writes in her expert opinion, Galina Kurdina has concrete evidence that psychotronic weapons exist and she experiences, experiences the symptoms of such weapons. Yet no one is looking into this evidence as a possibility for her symptoms and instead are diagnosing her as a psychotic, a psychotic person. It is distressing when a physician is unwilling to look at the authentic evidence available that might explain the symptoms and prevent labeling the patient with a serious mental condition. The psychiatrist in question should be instructed to do the necessary investigation of said information and report back why he is not willing to accept the possibility of a new diagnosis of post-traumatic stress disorder due to psychotronic weaponry. Dr. Steiner actually shows that Dr. Uh, D.F. and the same about Dr. Grazza is negligent because he doesn't want to investigate reported facts, research and look at the available authentic evidence of psychotronic weapons attacks. Joyce Myers, a duly qualified expert in the field of psychotherapy and treatment of victims of psychotronic weapons, wrote in her expert opinion, Ms. Cordina asked me to write another letter stating that the psychiatrist in question is negligent. I do not wish to stick my neck out as I value my life, but I do need to support my own moral integrity or life is worth nothing, so I shall speak. In my clinical opinion and according to my personal as well as researched knowledge in the arena of targeted citizens, the psychiatrist in question gave an incorrect diagnosis based on limited understanding of root causes of symptoms. The psychiatric profession itself has a limited perspective of trauma, along with a lack of desire to understand the core traumas that give rise to symptoms. It is easy to dismiss Ms. Cordina's symptoms uh, as psychosis if one doesn't want to do the necessary legwork to ascertain what created her symptoms, particularly when she has forwarded information that can be easily researched and validated in order to provide a proper clinical diagnosis. Ms. Cordina has been marginalized and dismissed because it feels easier and safer to, lab to label her rather than search for the unpopular and disturbing underlying truth. To dismiss her case is a cowardly act. Uh, Joyce Myers is sure that Dr. D.F., the same about Dr. Grazza, is negligent because he doesn't want to do the necessary work to ascertain what created my symptoms, despite the forwarded information about psychotronic uh, or directed energy attacks that can be easily researched and validated. Joyce Myers, duly qualified expert in the field of psychotherapy and treatment of victims of psychotronic weapons, wrote in her expert medical opinion, uh, the post-traumatic stress disorder, um, this is her diagnosis of my symptoms, is a direct result of directed energy weapons attacks, uh, compounded but not being taken seriously by those in authority positions she had turned to for help and relief. She wrote in her expert, um, the second expert opinion, Ms. Cordina has been marginalized and dismissed because it feels easier and safer to label her rather than search for the unpopular and disturbing underlying truth. Joyce Myers is sure that I have been marginalized and developed a serious post-traumatic stress disorder because, uh, because of labeling with false psychiatric diagnosis by Dr. D.F., the same about Dr. Kratzer. She is sure that Dr. D.F. has caused and contributed to my damage. 
Uh, Dr. June Steiner, duly qualified expert in the field of hypnotherapy and treatment of victims of psychotronic weapons, wrote in her expert medical opinion, uh, her symptoms have been complicated by the fact that those treating her are not familiar with directed energy weapons. Therefore, the problems have heightened because she doesn't experience being believed or supported thereby increasing her stress. Her functioning is greatly impacted in most areas of her life and therefore her work and relationships are very difficult. The impact of not being believed is harmful to her a state of well-being. She wrote in her expert opinion, uh, the second expert opinion, the diagnosis creates serious infringements on her life and therefore must be given only when all other possibilities have been exhausted. The misdiagnosis also prevents the patient from getting the appropriate treatment for the problem. Dr. June Steiner is sure that the misdiagnosis of Dr. Dieff increases my stress, impacts most areas of my life, is harmful to my state of well-being, creates serious infringements on my life, prevents from getting the appropriate treatment, the problem. Uh, she is sure that Dr. Dieff, the same about Dr. Grazza, has caused and contributed to my damage.